hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel so guys today in this video i'm gonna tell you how to fix iphone ghost touch issues in ios 17 so guys many ios 17 users are complaining about after updating to the latest version of ios 17 they are facing an issue of ghost touch so guys if you are also facing this type of issue and looking for a fix so you are in the right video in this video i'm gonna tell you how to fix this issue so guys, first is first. First of all, you have to do is clean the screen. Ensure that your iPhone's screen is clean. Sometimes dirt, oil, or debris on the screen can cause erratic touch. After this, then you have to do is restart your iPhone. A simple restart can often resolve minor software glitches. Turn off your iPhone by going to your settings, scroll down, and then tap on General. Again, scroll down, then tap on Shutdown. Shut down your iPhone and then restart it after 15 to 20 seconds later. If restarting doesn't work, then you have to do is update your iOS version. Insecure that your iPhone is running the latest version of iOS 17. Apple often release updates that include bug fixes and performance improvements. So you have to go to your software update and check if there is any available update for your iPhone. If there isn't, simply update your iPhone to the latest version of iOS 17. After this, then and you're still facing the issue, then you have to do is check your Calibrate touch screen. Some users have reported success by uh, reported success by recalibrating the touch screen. To do this, you have to go back, then go to your accessibility. Now tap on touch. Now scroll down. Sorry, scroll up. Now tap on haptic touch. And you have to make sure that it's on fast. If it's on default, then you have to do is tap on it fast. If also this doesn't work and you're still facing the issue, then you have to do reset all settings on your iPhone. If the issue persists, you can try resetting all settings on your iPhone. This won't delete your personal data, but it will reset your system settings to their default. To do this, you have to open your general, scroll down and then tap on transfer or reset iPhone, tap on reset, tap on reset all settings, enter your passcode and fix your issue. So guys, if this video helps you then make sure to like and subscribe my YouTube channel for upcoming videos and thanks for watching.